What up, people? Coach V, New Breed Boxing. Do amateur boxers get paid to fight? Do you get paid to box in the ring as an amateur? Another great question. No, you do not get paid to box in the amateurs. Not in the sense that a professional boxer receives a paycheck after a bout. No, you don't. In fact, it's the total opposite. In the beginning stages, you're going to have to actually pay to participate in amateur boxing. You got to pay for your USA boxing license. You got to pay for your training, your gym dues. You got to pay for your equipment. You got to pay for your travel. You got to pay for your food and whatever other extra, you know, things that you might, might, might want to implement into your training regimen or whatever. Um, and there are some organizations out there, some nonprofit groups that are, you know, geared towards, you know, financing amateur boxers' careers and stuff like that. But you better believe you're going to have to be paying your dues to even show them that you belong in that ring and you actually have the mental, physical, and spiritual fortitude to stick it out and make a career out of this because they're not trying to waste their time and money on just anybody because it can get expensive. Um, you know, amateur boxing is going to entail you at some point progressing onto the national level and then the international level. Now, that is where you will start seeing some kind of compensation in the form of sponsorships and that's a, a a big gray area because you may not be paying somebody for a fight but there have been cases where people have been you know illegally receiving payments and cash mainly from promoters trying to get in the good graces of a fighter you know before he turns pro so we can kind of preemptively have that relationship with him and kind of gain his trust and you know, it's not like back in the day when Don King would pop up at your favorite restaurant with a blank piece of paper and a bunch of cash and be like, sign your name here and I'll fill out the rest later. I don't think that's really happening like that anymore. Although I wouldn't be surprised if some people are still kind of pulling some funny moves. But you got to you gotta really be at the top of the food chain. You got to be somebody who's on his way to being, you know, a, a superstar. You know, and they know, I mean, once you spend a certain amount of time in the sport of boxing, like... You're not gonna, you, you're not gonna get to that level in a year. You know what I mean? You're gonna, it's obvious you're gonna pay your dues once you got a substantial amount of fights under your belt with a winning record. You've already proven the test of time. You've already shown these guys that you're battle tested, and you're not gonna stop because you know you, you know, provided you're still healthy and you're young enough. Not like a lot of these foreign amateurs that don't even get to turn pro until they defect from their country at the age of damn near 40, and at that point they already washed up. Spent way too, too, you know, too many years in the amateurs because it wasn't, they didn't have the option to get out, I guess. I don't know. But once you sit, like I said, once you get to the, to the uh, upper echelon of the, um, the amateur levels and they know you're going to turn pro, you're going to start getting all kinds of people that are going to start preemptively selling, you know, trying to just buy you, you know, that's straight up what it is. They're trying to buy your loyalty because once you turn pro from the amateurs, it's completely up to you who you go with. It's not like the NFL or something like that where you're getting locked in and that's the only deal in town. With the amateurs, you know, that's you're still like a free agent when you're turning pro from the amateurs to the pros, and you can go whoever you want to. You know what I'm saying? So these guys are kind of fighting for your uh, for your attention, so to speak. And with that, I guess money talks. So hope you found this informative. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Go check out my Instagram, coach.v underscore. And put in the comment section if you know of any stories of guys that were receiving, you know, some kind of compensation and what it was. And, you know, you got to put nobody's name out there, their business. But I'm always interested to see what kind of deals are being made out there, you know. Very interesting stuff. Anyway, hope you found this informative. Till the next time we up out of here. Out.